uh, when fish is under stress uh, because of parasites like ick they tend to uh, breathe heavy they might go to the surface just like this angel for now the system is running with cupramine that will kill the parasite but I'm going to give them a fresh water dip so that will give them some relief you see what he's doing So that type of reaction tells me I don't. I already saw it a little bit, of, a lot on his body, but give him that fresh water deep will we'll give him a lot of relief. Here to check the pH, you know, pH meter, very important. It's my really like Milwaukee, very reliable, easy, and uh, I'm just going to add some buffer. This is the buffer that I use, pretty affordable. I use it in these big quarantine systems that I have, and uh, it does the job. There's the reef one, but uh, now I'll use it for corals. But this one, fish, the marine buffer by Seacam. Let this pH just adjust a little bit, and then I can bring the fish. The parasites will die by osmotic shock because the, the parasites cannot regulate uh, the fluids going in and out of their body and what happens they the water just goes inside and explodes them except the ones that are protected by the mucus and uh, epidermic cell layers so but for the most part I'll say 80 90 percent might die if that exposed the other ones the cupramine eventually will take care of them You also want to put a timer. If, if there's sweets also they will end up dying. And you can see them flaking off. Next week this guy will go into a the 220 over there. I won't mind him to I don't mind if he eats uh, the leathers, it's all good. There's leather sponges over there for them to graze and nip. Also some algae. So that that's it for now. This is a freshwater dip.